Welcome back to Cord Cutters Live, where we help to save you money on your cable bill. Attention all Cody fans, the wait is finally over. The full stable release version of Cody 21 Omega is here. This is the next generation of the incredibly popular Cody media player that you can install on your Amazon Fire TV or Android and Google TV devices like the Nvidia Shield, Walmart's on 4K streaming box or any of the other streaming devices I reviewed here for you at Cord Cutters LI. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install Cody version 21 Omega on your Amazon Fire Stick. And when I'm done with that, I'll show you how to install one of my favorite official add-ons that will allow you to watch some great movies and TV shows on demand. It's quick and it's easy and I'm ready to show you right now. So if you're ready to learn how to install the world's most popular media player, grab your remotes and let's go. Put those remotes down for just a minute while I get this out of the way for YouTube's sake. This video is intended to show you how to install this popular media player on your streaming device. It may do a better job of it, but it's no different than any other media player by definition. Just like Microsoft Media Player, for example, or even a web browser. You can play your own media with it. You can access media with it. I am not showing you how to do anything illegal with this. In fact, everything I'm going to show you in today's video is 100% legal, 100% legit, and 100% official. So with that in mind, pick those remotes back up and let's get started. All right, so I am on the Amazon Fire Stick 4K Max second generation, but the installation procedure for this is virtually identical regardless of the streaming device that you're on, with only some minor differences. In order to get Kodi from the Cord Cutters Ally website, you, you will need an application called Downloader. If you have this already, you're all set, but if you don't have it, it's really easy to get. Go over to the magnifying glass, go down to search, and then just with the Alexa voice button, just search for downloader and you'll see it right there on the list if you don't have it yet just go ahead and click here and let it install after it's installed there's one setting that we have to check and so let's go over to the gear and move down to my fire tv and then go down to developer options now if you don't have developer options don't worry you can easily get that by going to about and then hovering over your device and just click seven times on the button. You see right there, it says no need, you are already a developer. If you see that, you're good to go. And we can go back a level and then go into developer options. Go down to install unknown apps and then go down to downloader and just make sure it says on. If it says off like this, just click that select button again and change that to on. And then we can go ahead and hit the home button. All right, so now we're all set to open up the downloader app and go to the Cord Cutters LI website where it says enter a URL or search term. You can either type in the web address cordcuttersli.com or you can type in the short code, which is 89364 and then click go. That's going to redirect you to the cordcuttersli.com website. It gives you this uh, display for a few seconds just to make sure you didn't make any mistakes when typing. When you get to the website, you're going to want to go ahead and hit the menu button on the remote. That's the one with the three lines. Two times. That will change this to full screen mode. While you're at my website, feel free to browse around and check out all the content available here for you. All sorts of stuff here that you can check out. But what we're interested in today is to go down to the menu over here on the left and click on that and then go down to where it says tutorials and click on that. And then moving along, if we scroll down, you will see a whole bunch of apps that you can install and play with if you want to. And down here next to media players, you will see Kodi 21 Omega. 32-bit recommended. This is the one that I recommend. Almost no devices use the 64-bit um, version. And even the ones that can use the 64-bit version, the 32-bit version works fine. So to make it simple and easy for everybody, I've just included this version. It's the full stable version available just this month, April 2024. If you scroll down here from last May, you'll see there's the video I did on the pre-release of Kodi 21 Omega. So it's nearly a year we've been waiting for this full stable version and uh, I'm so happy it's here, excited to, uh, to show it to you. So let's go ahead and click on that. You'll see some information about the version, the full stable release version. And if you scroll down all the way down towards the bottom of the page, you will see this 
download button where it says Cody 21 Omega, stable release, April 2024, and then click download. It's a little bit smaller than the previous version. The other one was like 74 megabytes. Move over to click install. When it's finished installing, just click done because this is gonna give us a chance to remove or delete this installation file because we no longer need it taking up space. So move over to delete and then delete again. And now we can go ahead and hit the home button. So now that Cody is installed, we're gonna to wanna to put it, no doubt, up on this favorites bar front and center so we can access it really quickly in the future. So to do that, you need to go over to this applications button and click on it. And then if you move to the left, you will see the last app installed is always gonna be at the bottom of the list and going to the left gets you there quick. So briefly tap that menu button again on your remote and you will see an option that says move to front and click on that. So now when we hit the home button, you'll see that Cody is right here, front and center. So now let's go ahead and open up Cody 21 because I'm gonna show you as promised, one of my favorite official Cody add-ons that will allow you to get some really cool movies and TV shows on demand. So let's go ahead and open it up. You'll get this message the first time you open up Cody that says that you require um, access to the media on your device. So you wanna just definitely choose the option while using the app because if you don't do this, it won't work. Same thing here, allow. So it's preparing to run for the first time. Cody 21, a new splash screen. So in a lot of Cody videos, this is where the creators will kind of like drop you off and leave you and, you know, leave you wondering, well, what do I do now? There's empty, there's no movies, there's no TV shows in here, there's nothing. So what I'm gonna show you is how to get to install an add-on. So from this main screen, you wanna go up to the top and select the gear and then move over to add-ons. You wanna go down to install from repository. So now we're gonna to wanna to move down and find video add-ons. And this is gonna be the list of all the official Kodi add-ons that you can install from the Kodi repository. I've already installed MeTV, check that out, that's pretty cool. Um, and then, let's see, I wanna pick the one that I've, uh, I really like, it's called Red Bull TV. You go ahead and click on that. And then down at the bottom right, you'll see an install button. Go ahead and click on that. You'll see the progress here. It says installing 50% and so on. And then when it's done, it says add on installed. So now let's hit the back button and go out to that main screen again. And now let's go down to add ons. As you can see, I installed MeTV earlier. All the add ons that you add will be here. We can just go ahead and open up. Let's go ahead and open up Red Bull TV. Red Bull TV has some live stuff. This is all action stuff, you know, sort of X Games type uh, sporting events, you know, skateboarding, skiing, surfing, all that stuff. So you can go into all this different stuff. Let's go into channels and I'll show you that. Yeah, so you have like some bike, adventure, motor, uh, surf. Let's hit surfing and you can just go into, let's just find something at random, basically. I'm going to have to blur the content, obviously, but you get the point. And it will bring you right into that content. Hit the select button, you move over to stop. So that's it. That is Cody Omega version 21 on your Amazon Fire Stick. So there you have it. Cody version 21 Omega full release, stable version, ready to install on your streaming device. If you enjoyed anything you saw here today, please go ahead and like the video. Subscribe to the channel, and as always, share this and all of your favorite Cord Cutters All I videos with your friends. This not only helps to get my videos shown to more people on YouTube, it also helps to support the channel. Thank you so much for watching.